Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we have some delicious kebabs with some vegetables. They're steak kebabs. I just kind of want to heat them up a little bit. I made a little shrimp cocktail out of the leftover shrimp that I used out of my Scooby-Doo cup. Freaking love Scooby-Doo. But I had some leftover shrimp from these shrimp spring rolls I made. So. Mm. Made a nice little cocktail. Check out these kebabs though. Don't those look delicious? We got steak, black olives, red bell pepper, and onion. Because I didn't want to open up all my colors of onion. And I didn't really want potatoes on this. So I went with some easy options here. Now, I also have here on the side some shrimp spring rolls that I made. But I don't want to put these on the hot part. So I'm just going to wait till I eat my skewers to dig into those. I also have some peanut sauce on the side there, which I'll show you what brand that is. I've never tried it, so we're, and I've never actually made spring rolls. So we're about to in, enjoy another new flavor. Doing mukbangs has really got me into some new food. I got some A1 sauce down here for my steaks. And I got a Shasta lemon lime soda for the beverage <laughs> sorry I don't have an ice maker, so I never really have ice unless I have like a cup that already has ice in it. So I'm sorry if you guys like to hear the sound of the rocks floating around, but I just don't have available. All right, let's try some of this kebab. I do have some plans for the future. Basically, what I really want is to do a live. Mm. But I think I was going to wait until I get 100 subscribers. Because then I can go live and celebrate. I like my steak nice and medium rare. Um, I want to celebrate, but... Um, what was I talking about? Um, I forgot what I was talking about. Oh, I want to wait until I get a hundred subs to go live because one, I'm nervous, and two, I wanted to do a special live. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, just all good. I'm gonna show you guys one of these shrimp spring rolls. They're all stuck together. Hold on a second. Well, this is annoying. lettuce and then there's some rice noodle in there and carrots and cabbage I'm gonna go ahead and try some in the peanut sauce nice dip Good old spring rolls. This steak's really good. <sighs> Spring rolls are super sticky. I didn't realize they were that hard to eat. <coughs> They're kind of hard to eat. steak is so good. I put a little A1 on it and then I like eating it with the onion. I'm just going to go ahead and take all my meat off the skewers here since I don't really need those anymore. This is a good meal. Oh. 
Yeah, so I do have a new idea for a new mukbang that I'm going to do when I go live, but I'm kind of nervous about going live. So I told myself I'll definitely go live if I get 100 subs. And I'm at like 70 right now. So it's possible. I just gotta keep pushing. So yummy. I made the mistake of laying one of my spring rows on top of the other ones. Not a good idea. <laughs> oh, that was a big one. God, they're just breaking apart on me. <clears throat> I've never made spring rolls before, so I don't know what I'm doing. This is so annoying. You know, when you just try to have a good mukbang and a good dinner, and I spend so much time preparing just to make it look good and just to like try it out. And then it turns out like this. Holes in it. It's so fucking annoying. Excuse my language. I'm just irritated because I'm just like, I spent so much time getting this together and now they're all falling apart. So I can't pick any of them up without a hole in it. It's so stupid. It just makes me mad. I only got one. The only one that doesn't have avocado in it. I'll drop the attitude, sorry. <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry, but these don't taste like they're supposed to. <sighs> I'm sorry, I couldn't do it anymore. Epic fail. I'm stupid mad about that. Whatever. Guess we'll just eat the freaking shrimp cocktail. <sighs> oh, that makes me so mad. Wasted so much time, effort, trying really hard to make it look good. I cooked everything. And then, it tastes like shit, for one. Excuse my French. It looks like shit. Sorry, I just can't get over how irritated I am about that. I'm sure you guys have had to deal with that before. Oh, so frustrating. <clears throat> Thank God I made these kebabs. <clears throat> and the reason why I even made the kebabs was because I was like, I don't even know if I'm going to like these. Well, at least y'all get a big laugh about some, me not being able to eat something like usual and I have to spit it out because I'm a stupid textural person. And I was like, this usually tastes good, but it's done today, not when I make it. Whatever. I'm over it. I'm never making shrimp bagels again. 
ever. I don't care. I'm throwing those away too. I'm sorry. Usually I eat my leftovers, but that has got me so mad that I'm just going to throw it away. You know how I get with my appetite, boo. I'm sorry. I ate everything with my hands too. I wasn't prepared. I didn't have a fork. I had everything on skewers and I was like, this is not working. And I was like, I'm not going in there for a fork. But anyways, it doesn't matter. Thanks for watching. Like always. <coughs> Stay safe. And we will eat again. Thanks, guys. <laughs>